Okay, this is a good place to start. This is at idhhb.com worklines blue line academy. Um, let's go. And what I do is see the three lines up here, hit the three lines, and this will show you all the parts of IDHHB. And this will show you all the parts of the blue line index. Okay, so of the blue line section. So blue line introduction, and then basics is what you want to do. And the reason we're going to go here is so that you can look at the folder overview. Okay, the first step in downloading files from Etsy and or from the uh, Blue Line Academy or from God Games is you have to uh, have your uh, file system set up. So here is your Blue Line folder overview. The important thing to see here is that you have a God folder with a subfolder of covers, graph GFX, models, SMD, WGM, and WGM2. These are the subfolders that you're going to need to have in order to insert the models into the models folder, the graphics into the GFX, the sounds into the SMD, and WGM, GM2 are all different effects of the models, etc. Okay, I already have this set up on my computer. Okay, and that is why I wanted to show you this that you need to kind of have this in place for your downloading from Etsy. Okay, because we're going to drop the different files into these folders. The files we download from Etsy will get dropped into these folders, and we have to make sure that each file gets put into a specific folder, okay? Um, you don't just drop everything into the GODD folder. It just doesn't work that way. You have to actually select the files and pull them over and drop them into it really isn't difficult once you get the hang of it, and it actually is a great skill to know using your uh, Windows uh, File Explorer. So not a bad thing to get to learn. Now I am going to go to Etsy. Okay, uh, Etsy.com. Etsy.com shop Norton Street Gallery, all one word with caps. Okay. Etsy.com slash shop Norton Street Gallery. Street Gallery. All right. And here are the offerings from Norton Street Gallery. Now I am going to go to on the left here. God Engine Materials, okay? And here you can see there are a lot of, a lot of uh, downloads available for the God Engine. Now, the one that you really want to start with, which will give you everything you need to start, is this Maze Builder. Okay, so if you're really just starting out, you can get the Maze Builder. And uh, that is a really good way to go. Okay, so you would buy it now or add to cart, whichever way you have set up. So God Maze Builder build, Building Kit for use at our workshops. That is a, a great one to get. I am going to get some plant models. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And 
Now I am going to, going to go ahead and buy it now. Now you don't need to see all of that. So um, I will go ahead and edit that out and I'll show you what happens after I do the purchase. So we now see that I have my order here. I get a receipt and it gets emailed when the files are ready to download. Okay. So I'm going to go off there. And now I go to my account and I go to purchases. Okay. Purchases. And here it is. This shows up. Purchase from Norton Street Gallery just today. God models plants for your God engine projects. Okay. So I am going to go ahead and download files. Okay. This is going to download the files that I bought into my download folder on my computer. Download files. And it has got one, two, three, four, five folders. So I'm going to go ahead and download each one of those separately. Download. It shows me when it's done. It, there's a pop up. OK, that's OK. Everybody has been downloaded. OK, now I am going to actually close this page because I don't need this page. Remember, it was under my account and purchases. OK, that's where you'll find your downloads. OK, and then I just download them to my computer from Etsy. OK, now I'm going to go to my file explorer. And I'm going to open my downloads page and let me close this. Let me expand this. There we go. So this shows the folders. I downloaded one of them twice. I got impatient. So I'm going to go ahead and delete this. So I don't get confused. OK, so now I've got mod. 1, mod 2, mod 3, mod 4, mod 5. Okay. Now, at the beginning, I would su suggest just select each one individually, hit that, go up and click the pink extract. Okay. And then it shows over here, extract all. And it is going to put them in the same downloads folder, which I is what I do. OK, so I'm just going to let it extract it to the downloads folder. OK, there's models one. OK, that's showing that in that folder. OK, I don't need to see that right now. Here's mod uh, mod one is right here. It's showing it right alongside its zip file. Mod 2, extract up here, and then extract all. And the same thing, extract. Close that. I don't need that. See how it shows that they're open? Here's number 3, extract, and extract all extract and x mod 4 extract extract all and extract okay i'm just opening up zip files that have been downloaded from etsy And we do five. I just hit this extract just to make sure it's selected. 
and then I do the extract all. You can probably go to directly to the extract all, but I just I've gotten used to doing it that way. Just I think it's a double check for me and X. Okay, here are my downloaded and opened extracted folders. Okay, now here's how I do it. And I think that people have different ways of doing this, but I just want to show you how I do it. I go ahead and open up on the left side here. I hit the this little arrow beside the God folder. I hit the little arrow by the graphics folder and the little arrow by the sound folder. Okay, so over here on my left, you can see this looks exactly like the thing we looked at before in the um, in the Blue Line Academy. Okay, so now if I come up to my downloads, these should stay open for me. Now I've got my downloads over here. Okay. And I scroll down just to make sure I've got my God folders open here. Everybody's still open. Then I open uh, Mod 5. Okay, so here it says WGM2. That was right. Uh, Control A. selects everything. Control C copies it and WGM2 and now I go Control V. And I'm going to replace the files in that destination. Okay, good. I'm going to go, actually go back to my downloads. Okay, and now I'm going to do mod four. I open it up. This is WGM2. I double click it to open up all those folders. And I'm going to do Control A to select all, Control C to copy all. These are also going to go into the WGM2 folder, Control V. Okay, I'm going to replace the files in the destination with the newer files. Okay, back up to my downloads. Um, I'm on three. Okay, control A. And then I do control C. Then I go down to my models folder underneath the God engine and here is models. Open that and I do my control V. Those are all new models. Okay, great. Back to my downloads. I now go to two. And I double click and open that and control a and back to my god folder 
here's God, well, here's models, uh, open that, and control V to paste it in. So we're going to replace those files. They might be, uh, they might have been updated by in some way or other. Do uh, downloads, and now I'm on one, mod one, double click, models one, and now I'm going to do control A. And then I'm going to do control C. And then I'm going to go down to my models folder. And I'm going to do control V. And that pastes all those in there. Okay. And that completes opening up the folders that I downloaded from Etsy and put into my downloads file. Then I extracted them. There we go. Thank you.